I'm gonna show you today. I'm gonna show you how to install a expandable expansion tank on a hot wind, in the water heating system. Uh, I basically I'm gonna cut this piece, and I'm also gonna change the valve, and I'm gonna put the water tank. So every house needs to have one. It's because this one is a brand new. I replaced a 924. 2017 and today is a uh, 10 to 2017. That was a week ago, and the and the, the pressure valve and it start dripping water. So it's because the pressure. So I'm gonna put that water tank in here, and that should stop leaking. It's a very easy. All you need to do is to buy it shark bite push to connect and should be very easy to install. I'm going to cut and I'm going to set up and I'll put it back in the next video so you're going to see how easy it is. Well, well, one thing to remember, before you cut any pipes on your house after you close the main, reg the main, reg main valve on your house, remember to go upstairs and open the faucet so the pressure can go up oh we're gonna be a mess like I did right now so I cut off this piece as you see I put already this one so I could do no back the other one is here just snap no weld I cut this stretch I don't need it now we're gonna need some tape some plumber tape we're gonna put in here Clockwise, because you're gonna use. Gonna put some. Then that's what I'm gonna do. Make sure it's not gonna leak. Did I mess here? Let me see. I don't think this is enough, but. Oh, I'm not a plumber, so I'm just doing a fix on my house and showing how I'm doing. That's it. But that should do. I cut up the pieces. I I push to connect. Now I'm gonna put it here. I'm gonna tie it up. that's not <laughs> yeah things fine and then I'm gonna push to connect in here No welder. That tube is already connected. Now I'm gonna need a piece to connect here and here. So I'm gonna measure.
use this tool to clean up the tool, the, the pipe. Wipe it off. Check one more time. Push to connect. Push to connect. Here. <coughs> now turn back on the water. And look. And look to see if you see any leak. I don't think they have they have it here. And that should be all set. Remember, always when you're gonna talk, you're gonna work on the water heater, turn off the pilot, turn off the gas, or you're gonna damage your tank. So right now that should be all set, and this should stop leaking. I hope you enjoy. And then uh, I'm gonna put a post a uh, picture of all, to all the tools that I use and all the materials I use. I hope you like. I'm not a plumber. I'm just doing this for my first time. But it's very easy. You don't need to weld or nothing. Just put back in. It's all set. Well, after the installation is complete, that's how it looks like. There is no leak. Nicely done. No welder. And clean. That's how it looks like after complete. Not bad for a guy who doesn't know anything about plumbing. Life is easy now.